Happy holidays, Illini family. You know, it's the end of the year, and I'm trying to catch up on some correspondence with everything that's happened this fall. Our run to the Final Four with the volleyball team, I've fallen a little behind. And something I try to do more often than not is to send a handwritten thank you note to, to people who have really contributed to making this program so special and who are, will continue to play an important role as we can continue along our path towards progress and success. I thought you might want to listen in, hear a few thoughts as I pen these notes to these folks and again celebrate the end of the 2018 year. Thank you to the Marching Illini for being the heart and soul of Memorial Stadium, State Farm Center, and Huff Hall. Your dedication and hard work are appreciated. Others say it, but you demonstrate it week after week. You are the best band in the land. I wouldn't run a 5K with a sousaphone for any other band anywhere. You'll be getting a letter from my lawyer regarding my shoulder replacement. Thank you to our Illinois athletic staff. Your countless hours and unrelenting dedication clear the path for our success. You always step up to the occasion like when I ask you to host regular season high school football games in the stadium, or when we created the Hall of Fame, or decided to play football game at Soldier Field, or agreed to host the NCAA's new youth basketball recruiting camps, or bid on NCAA championship events, or stage a fundraising summit, or try to add a Division I hockey program. Jeez. I hope you enjoy a couple of free hours you'll get on Christmas Day. I'll try not to send you a text. They're the best. Our staff is the best. Now speaking of hockey, thank you to our new Fighting Illini hockey fans. No, wait. I guess we don't really have anything to report on that one just yet. I sure do like hockey, though. More to come. Thank you to our student athletes who continue to humor me even though I'm now way older than they are. Your drive has brought you to the best university on the planet. Your blood, sweat, and tears inspire me and every other member of the Fighting Illini family. We watch you struggle we see you grow, and we cheer as you leave here prepared to tackle the world. <laughs> Take it from a new dad. Before too long, you'll consider getting up at 6 a.m. to be sleeping in. Thank you to all the donors who have stepped up and shared in our bold vision for the future of Illinois athletics. Through your generous donations, we have announced more than $47 million in gifts over just the last 12 months to fund projects like the Mersion Park, our new soccer and track and field complex, the Atkins Baseball Training Center, and of course, the Smith Football Center. <laughs> Next on the list, I am looking for someone to help with the Tate Whitman Slip and Slide Complex to be located in my backyard. Give me a shout. Thank you to our Fighting Illini fans. We've had our share of ups and downs, yet you remain as loyal and steadfast as any fan base in the country. I appreciate your dedication, your enthusiasm, and your unrelenting thirst for excellence. Our day is coming.
And that's no joke. Thank you to my beautiful wife, Hope, for giving up your own career, moving to a new place, being twice as far from your family, having two kids in two years, and single parenting far too often. Your patience and your support mean more than I can ever fully explain especially with all the desserts. I know that's not your favorite part of the meal, but you still let me get it almost every time. That means a lot. And finally, thank you to my daughter Tate and my son Will. You've opened my eyes to the joys of fatherhood, which exceed even my greatest imagination. Sorry about all the games, but watching them with you has been an indescribable thrill. And you sure do look cute in your orange and blue. P.S. I'm trying to get all my mistakes out of the way now, since you won't remember them anyway. That's it for now. Happy holidays, Illini. Let's make 2019 a year to remember.